2K Sports, in association with the PGA Tour, is proud to bring you the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today's coverage of the Wells Fargo Championship is about to begin. Pleased you could join us for this final round action. Luke Elvey alongside 2002 PGA winner Rich Beam. And Rich, do you fancy this player's chances? Look, this player has got a massive lead, and sometimes those are the worst to have because you feel as a player the only way that you can lose it is if you mess it up. And trust me, somewhere in the back of their mind, this player understands that. So it's going to be a nervy start, no doubt, to this final round. Let's wait to see what happens. Looking forward to this, Rich. Let's get into the action. And let's see what he can do here today. Playing this shot from about 180 yards. And choosing the eight iron here. Should find the green. Oh, that one's absolutely stiff. Well, oh, that's beautifully judged. Gotta like their chances from there. Lining up the birdie putt here. That's signaling your intent. Go and get amongst it early. Game face on early here, Luke. He sits in first position. And this is quite an astonishing performance by our leader. Their advantage now out to double digits. I'm not sure if the chase back is good enough to catch them. That'll work, that's fine. And what's in front of them there, Henny? I'd say he's about 165 from this flag. Going with the eight iron here. Club up. I like this play. Oh, that's a great shot. It sets up a wonderful birdie look here at the second. Nearly doesn't get any better than that. Amazing shot. Oh, well played. And I like it two in a row. And with that hole finished, they're currently in the lead with Brooke Henderson following in second. It's time to begin this powerful hole. That a boy, good shot. And they're playing from about 140 yards out. Oh, this is on a fantastic line. Is it the right distance? Oh, stop it. What a shot. Already had a few birdies today. This for another. You know, Luke Donald once made all 400-plus attempts inside three feet on the PGA Tour. And a quick glimpse at the leaderboard now. And this player holds the lead, with Brooke Henderson trailing in second place. Looking to ride the momentum after coming off a birdie here with this shot. to have opted for the eight iron. Yeah, that's a good line. That should find the surface. Beautiful. Yes, got to think that's a certain birdie from there. You can mark it down. That's birdie number four today. Just the start they were looking for, Luke. And with that hole finished, they're currently in the lead 
with Brooke Henderson following in second. It's time to step on the tee here at the fifth. Well, this one looks to be heading down the runway. Standing up over this one after a bunch of birdies. Always a good way to start. Let's see where they go from here. Opting for the 9-iron. Nine -nine. That was never really a comfortable shot for them, was it? One of the rare misses for this player today, Luke. They've been handling a lot of greens today. And a par putt awaits him. And a quick glimpse at the leaderboard now. And this player holds the lead, with Brooke Henderson trailing in second place. Time to tee off at the sixth. Going with the five wood. A wonderful shot, well played, a chance for Booty here at the sixth. Four feet to the cup. This one's looking good. And racking up their fifth Booty of the day. And with that hole finished, they're currently in the lead with Brooke Henderson following in second. And after a birdie at the last, they take the honour on the hole. Oh, that's piped. That's heading down the runway. What kind of shot are they facing here, Henny? Setting up here from about 190 yards. Opting for the six iron. This one looks to be on a pretty good line. Oh, that's great. It just missed the hole. Outstanding approach shot. 12 feet to the cup coming up. They'll be soaring high if this goes in. This one for Eagle. Oh, you're going to be hard to catch now if you keep making putts like that. Managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard. We've arrived at a par four hole. Really hoping they play this one aggressively. Second shot here on the eighth. And that's an impressive little chip. Such soft hands. Still in the lead now after that hole. And they'd be feeling buoyed with confidence after that birdie. Here's a good chance to maintain the momentum. And Henny, what are you seeing down there? Setting up here from about 155. Looks like they're going with the pitching wedge. Oh, that one's straight at the pipe. 
What a shot. Almost went in the bucket. No harm, no foul there with that shot. Be nice to see this one go down. Let's see if they make it. It's a lofty position this player has held all tournament, but what a buffer they've built with just night of play. Could be some trying times indeed. Tough holes lay ahead, but yes, you're in the position that you want to be ahead of the pack. This hole is a par five. Luke, this player coming off a birdie on the last hole, getting some momentum going their direction. Left nothing in the tank on that one. That was pummeled. Second shot here on the tenth hole. Well, that's a tremendous shot and sets up a wonderful opportunity. Using the big muscles to get it home in two there. Well, this would be a bonus. This is a very long putt. Oh, what a shame. That would have been a nice one to hold. Well, I think they fell in love with the line, forgot about the pace. And a quick glimpse at the leaderboard now. And this player holds the lead, with Brooke Henderson trailing in second place. Always the toughest hole in the game. A long par four. Good shot there, Beamer. Penny, what have they got in front of them here? And from around 135 yards. Yeah, good safe shot, this one. That should find the surface. Ooh, just skin the hole, that one. A wonderful shot. A chance for Bernie here on the 11th. And they've been rolling the ball great today. Another great look. A chance for a birdie if this goes down.
Yeah, well hold. Let's move on to the next. And with that hole finished, they're currently in the lead with Brooke Henderson following in second. The play so far has been stellar, increasing the lead, Luke, but can they maintain it? Let's find out. Looks like they put a good pass on that one. <laughs> Playing from 110 yards out. Going with the 9-iron, I think. This one is chewing fibre. Yeah, nicely played. This putt is 16 feet to the hole. Short game has been absolutely fantastic today. Oh, yeah, this is tracking nicely. Look at him just surging ahead at the top of the leaderboard. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. Pretty sure this player will be buoyed by that birdie back at the last. Let's see if they can deliver another one. Fairways and greens, easy game, isn't it? It's amazing to see how good this player is in full flow. Always nice to hold those for a birdie. And a quick glimpse at the leaderboard now. And this player holds the lead with Brooke Henderson trailing in second place. Lovely momentum for this player after that birdie at the last hole. Keep it rolling. This hole is so important at this critical time. Go for it, lay it back. How much do you trust your swing? Well, it was a bold strategy, but it looks like it's going to pay off. Ah, oh, don't you love the long ball, Rich? Drive your par four. Is there a few things more thrilling in the game? Oh, what a play. You know that. I love it when players are aggressive. Way to go. What a shot. It's tracking. Oh, that had eyes for a lovely shot. And staying right where they were in today's rankings after that. Well, that's huge momentum they're bringing to this hole. Coming off the eagle, time to hit another good drive. You like that, didn't you? This shot here from about 240 yards.
opting for the three wood. That's a pretty handy shot. Not able to find the green in two, but a bold play. And missing it long with that approach, not a good leave. What are we looking at for this putt, Henny? He's got 10 feet here. I think he likes it. This one's looking good. Nice little putt to hold that one. Whew, that is some pretty good breathing room out in front by a bunch. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. Three holes remaining, folks. Hang on to your hats. This is going to be a wild and woolly finish. Time to face a par four. This shot is looking good here. Oh, he's been putting on a clinic all day. Another beauty by our leader. They say drive for show, putt for dough, but that was plenty of show there. And choosing the eight iron here. Yeah, that one's looking good. Well, there's a very good reason why he's leading this tournament, and that's Exhibit A. Dare I say, Luke, this player has been in fuego with his approach shots. Another green in regulation. Pretty straightforward four-footer coming up here. He's staring down a birdie putt here. The putt drops, and that's back-to-back -back birdies. Back-to-back -back birdies moving the right direction there, Luke. currently in first position two holes to go Luke I know who I like always positive coming off a birdie let's see what happens here <laughs> looks to be going with a hybrid here Mm. That's right out of the copy books. Exquisite. Of all the shots that I like the most, that one ranks right up there. This is a good chance. Beautiful shot. And after that performance, they'll stay right where they are in the standings. And now this player tees off their final hole of the event with the lead. Oh, that's outstanding. Another great shot by our leader. I don't... That drive, he hit it so far, there's no divots in the fairway where he hit it. Look at the line on this one. Get in the hole. That's a lovely shot here at the 18th and a chance for Birdie at the last. Well, that's a beauty. You can put it in the win column. That's the Wells Fargo Championship. How about that? You can take that win to the bank, Luke. Awesome.
You know, Rich, we saw from the get-go that this 